Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Divide and Conquer as we are continuing our Woodland Realm campaign. Last episode we ended with um, with being attacked by this Isengard army and today we are taking on the weapons against Isengard. So the strategy, strategy sh should be quite simple, block the bridge with our halberdiers and shoot them with our archers and catapults while they are blobbing up against the wall, against the bridge. Start deployment. Right, we do have three catapults at our disposal, so they should... Um, they should, they should be like that. We got two units of quite healthy halberdiers. We want them out of formation. We do not want them in protective uh, area. These guys will be down here. Um, oh, these guys need a backup on him. Damn it. Alright, the scouts don't have much purpose in this battle. I'm glad we have a unit with them, with us. Let's see. Down. Alright. Need them. Yeah, just do as I say. Do that thing. Kill him. These guys we need also, they need to be one who hold the line. Alright. Move quickly. Yeah, we should change that. Just like that. Move quickly. Now, you need to get behind him. Form a wider circle around it like that, and we have you in reserve, just like you. You guys already in range. All right, then. Oh. Fire at will, now we can go.
Oh wait, you can find now. Right, we're doing quite okay. But we should stop them from firing. I just get out of can we get out of there? But I'm well I'll just get in. blobbing up we already killed 30 percent of them so that's looking good Alright, we killed almost all of, the, of them.
seem to be done for a lot push or something good that will definitely break some morale yeah most of them are fighting to the death that's not best but we'll ensure that our troop You guys, destroy. Yeah, this far gone. And battle. We lost 200 men, we killed over 2,000 men. 49 of these guys. 89 of them, that's very nice. Only 8 of them, that's not great. Damn. Nevertheless, we have done a wonderful job. And already destroying another Isengard army, but our troops, but our troops are running quite thin, and recruitment nearby is not that great. So hopefully, we are all we are really damaging the strength of Isengard. I think they are doing pretty well in the eastern, western side, nearby Ariador. I think they conquered quite a lot there. And if they aren't already going for Gondor. But as long as we are destroying army after army of Isengard, we should be distracting them from attacking Gondor at least. Ten facts. Alright. Adoras is still alive. Here we have quite some units. Should be able to withstand that. Not another army. Alright. Let's see, what do we have? We should send back these guys. These guys. Guys and these guys. Can't send them back there. We have to send them back all the way over there. Just like them. We do have some troops coming in, that's good. Are you fucking... Are you seriously? Damn Lavorian. Hopefully, as 
some more rocks in here. But less archers, which is good. And these guys... Oh, they do have hunters, but they are not that much of a threat. These ballastites might cause some annoying. Damn, Maron on the sea, by who? I'm quite curious. Meanwhile, how are things going down here? Money, at least. Can we retrain these guys? Yes, we can. Go down to here. What can we train here? Nothing, because we are training quite a lot already. Alright. That should provide some more money. These guys will link up with them all over here. Alright. Not doing too bad. Let's continue. Oh, more free upkeep. That's good. Provide us some more financial possibilities. for those Lorian scouts which do pretty alright actually but are not uh, nothing compared to for example <laughs> the royal swan god of Dolamrod which is of course one of the best uh, strike cavalry but even some lesser uh, Amrotian cavalry do act would be so useful even some cavalry from Rohan would do. Which sounds strange, cause uh, Rohan is one is is like the um, faction for um, cavalry. Alright, they were treated. Where the hell did they go? One point back, but that's alright. Not too bad for us. Fuck off. I want to send you back down there. Alright, we retrain the Galadon Guard in Rochburg. Can we retrain God on God to him? Oh no, it's a weapon upgrade. I was already wondering. We did train one of those guys. So they are welcome over there. Anything else? Not that much. Alright. Any more troops coming in? No. Yeah. 
you guys. I'm Alvin King Bogart, which are welcome but not that necessary. I would more archers. I would have more use on these guys, for example. And the one that just came in are uh, helpful as well. So altogether it's not that bad. Where are our bloody? Got a doom. Can I be able to? A thousand, maybe? Yes. Damn, thank you. Already spent again, but it doesn't matter. Because it should be spent to troops then. I don't know where. But here are we already building that dude. And we don't, here we not. Accomplish anything either. Don't need anything over here. Not training in here, not training in here. Why the hell are we training? Alright, we're training in here. But we already did if I was right. We're training here. Oh, damn, that's not good. Yeah, we only train in there. Doesn't matter. I do have more diplomats. The other is in the king's land. So we do that. Map information. And the morning means we have been asking before. Why don't you try to sell it? Damn. And of you. Marksman, these guys most seem to be. Oh, these guys are good. Still can't read this, not that great. Not quite familiar with the roster of deal anymore. Didn't seem like a very great help. They should have enough. Especially if you don't have that great unit. <laughs> they have strong enough cavalry units.
have to make them as long as possible. Both are facing my line. Now the archers. None of them are already planted. Yes, just end the battle. Oh, another two healed, one experience, and an army gone. So I say mission completed. We save Rowan for another day. Which, which means that Isengard will try to push next turn with another army. But as long as they do it as, with the armies as we just faced, they can come every day of the week. Not sure we have enough movement points to get back, but... Probably not. Oh, we do. That's actually quite nice. Damn, that was nice. Alright. Eisengard is moving back at this moment at least. But let's hope that we'll turn our tide. Um, we do have quite some general in here. Yeah, we should, we should try to. Alright. Just like that. Uh -huh. Here we can't do much more. You guys can turn the fort like that. Uh -huh. Let's see what else do we got. Is there more training over here? Are there training over here? Oh, okay. Alright, just get another turn in. Let's just hope that Isengard doesn't attack us at the bridge until our reinforcements have arrived. 
So in that way we can uh, we have some more me hopefully some more melee infantry to defend to defend that bridge. But further on, we're doing actually pretty alright. Except that Adoros is thief at this stage. Damn Adoros. Damn Isengard actually. Adoros thief. Uh, Ostilian lost, but not. I'm ready to upgrade. Yeah, just when you're done. Recruitment report on the little hole. You move to there. Let's see, um, first move on, first move these guys to here, these guys to here, move these guys to Amon Lung, at least one of you guys will be coming along, seven bloody times, damn. Yeah, we just gonna link you guys up. So you're not really a noteworthy army. Oh, wait, before we do anything. Get a power up and running. Here too. Want to know what's going on. And what Isengard might not might not try the neutral fortunately we do have some reinforcements coming down do we have more? I don't think so surrounded by three, four bloody armies. How long before this invasion is over? They're not coming, and I'm not giving in. I 
Let's see, come on, come on, what do we have? And Ruin has trained some troops in the center, isn't it? Damn it. Quite out in the way. Alright. Link up. Move on. We have still nothing. Uh, 
still have with Luan. I mean with Kaza. This we broke our line with Kaza Doom. Since when? When was this we broke? Neither of them are our allies. Alright, this is strange. Alright, let's see. Um, they are not anymore at war. Erebor. Erebor is only at war with Rune, so we should be able to re-establish our lines with the dwarves. Which to prove quite useful, and we should be able to um, re-establish our lines with the other dwarf. Right, but first, we need to go to the next turn. Now we have full visual over Fangorn Forest, so there's no way they're gonna slip by in there. Yes, that's, that should be, that should be it. It's quite annoying, because I thought we had both, that we had an alliance with Kazakh Doom. I knew we broke with Erebor, because I was right, Arad Lewin attacked them. They seem to have resolved peace. Are oh, we already back at the end turn? Seriously? Damn, that's nice. Right, we have this one over here in a car. Announcement coming of age. Oh, cool. In here, alright. Getting away to my general fireway. He has freed himself. Are you bloody serious? Why the hell is he by the way? Oh, here. Oh, okay. They barely killed anything, but nevertheless. We finally got them by. Mm, we cannot retrain them in Amon Lunk. We already have something to retrain there. Um, Alright, 
Alright, then we're gonna see our first Horse Archer unit in action. Never liked Horse Archers, because I'm not very good with them. Guys over here, you guys over here. Alright, oh, they come in from this side, that's actually quite alright. Let's try to arrest them with the horse archers. How good is their occurrence? They're pretty good. They do have a pretty good occurrence. Open spear guard. We need to take them out. Maybe. Oh wait, no, no, no. Let's start to arrest them. Let's start to arrest the horse then. They are way faster than that.
We actually need to kill some more guys, because with this we're not getting this army from the battlefield. Now we only have to break them. Rowan can, can do that on his own. I think at least. Good. Alright, four heal of each. That's not that great, but... Not, sorry, not the greatest, but enough. Get another army gone. So that brings that brings the total defeated armies this episode on three, I guess, I think, I hope. Maybe more. But actually done a quite a good job to defeat Isengard. Execute them all. It is a five. Let me down on the Alright. Oh. Can you use them? We need to use them. Because our cover is not yet returned. Um, annoying okay. Yes, such a good relationship. Why don't they want the alliance? He's training in here. Fuck you. Yes. Okay, 
that one. Oh, we can return this one as well. Alright, alright. Finally, we're getting something done. Ballastai, get them as soon as possible. That's unfortunate. Down the roof has fallen. Um, yeah, we are at our, our gameplay. We have an army over here from Lothlorien, which seems to be quite a decent army. The Father's Chosen, good Halberdier's unit. Lothlorien Warden. Go for lag. These are good, but they are very short range. And uh, can remember. Uh, it's good that, that that army reached that area. So, so we will try to do the same. Take these guys with us. Take these guys. Oh, not all of you guys. Uh, yes, yes. What do we have left here? Yeah, that should be enough. Right, there is a big army on the way. So, Adoras. There is a Lord Lorian army ahead of it. Keep one of our generals in here. There's another army of trolls in here. Damn, I'm going to. Um, maybe our horsemen can do something with that. In the meantime, alright, we're training to start getting up and running. Oh, we are building our grain exchange. That's good. We aren't building anything in here. Um, I need to try to get this guy down here. I'm on lunk. There we have some retraining. Really suck that this area is completely locked off from the outside world. We have some catapults. Don't have any ballast ties. I think they are a little better against these units. Here we have some troops.
Now let's try it again. Dynamo because they also at war with the Anduin, which are still my ally. Brings like a thousand in extra. Good. I told the last turn would be the last, but it seems like next turn will be last, and then we will end the episode, because uh, accidentally I already clicked next turn when I realized uh, I should end the video. Um, yeah, we're doing pretty alright, especially against Isengard. Um, and I think we are about to turn the tide. I really hope so, because we are destroying army after army. And, um, oh damn, not again. Gondor weakening. Get for thousands. We are building some small things. Alright, damn, and I told we are doing pretty well, and then we have like three armies coming in. We have no trolls in here, good thing. We do have trolls in here, 12 of them, they do have a lot of siege equipment. Nice that Lord Lorien is also in really involved in this battle. 
Why the hell is he on that other army? They would have helped so much. Alright, uh, but nevertheless, I'm gonna end the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If so, please leave a like. And uh, if you wanna see more, subscribe to the channel. And I hope to see you next time. Until And until then, I say goodbye.